Hey y'all, what's up? It's your girl Reese and welcome back to another Spiritual Love Jones general energy reading for my beautiful divine feminines. All right, you already know this will be general. So take what resonates and if it does not, leave that shit where it's at, okay? All right, so let's go ahead and jump right in and let's see what spirit got for y'all. The bottom of the deck, we got sweet thing. Okay. All right, spirit, what do you have for my beautiful divine feminines? What do you have for my beautiful divine feminines? Okay, that's too many. <laughs> Some of y'all gonna be having a lazy weekend also. Um, it's okay. I'm just letting you know right now. It's okay. Relax, chill out, get you some rest, get you some self care in. So go ahead and get like your work, whatever little task you need to get done. Um, I just feel like it's gonna be real cozy, a cozy weekend. Much needed for you though. The one thing. Much needed. I see some cuddling. I see some foot rubbing. <laughs> Y'all, what in the heck? Y'all see them cars just over there? Okay, let's see. So we got happy. Okay. I love you. Mm. Okay. Time to go with it. So like I said, um... You know, some of y'all gonna be having like a little lazy weekend, some downtime this weekend, just really chill vibes, really relaxed. Um, I hear a lot of I love yous. This is from different people that you could be around family this week, you know, with the holidays and stuff coming up. Um, your kids, your your special person. I just hear a lot of I love you. It's just a lot of love around. And then you're going to be happy. You're just going to like have a very peaceful energy about you. Like I said, just kind of like vibing out, chilling, candles lit, music playing. You might have you a little glass of wine or something like that. But you're just going to be, you know, taking some time to reflect to yourself, okay? Look at this. Loving you is easy. So someone might even come out and tell you that they love you or tell you how they feel about you if this person has never told you before, but they want to let you know like loving you is easy because you just automatically just, just loving you automatically makes this person happy, makes this person stay better. And I also feel like you're not like um, egotistical, you're not full of drama or anything like that. So this person could have dealt with like someone who was like argumentative in the past or someone who was just always on their bumper. But I feel like you just are kind of like a, you know, oh, I'm just going with the flow. You know, whatever happens with us happens. But this person feels like it's so easy to just love you. <clears throat> so we got who cares. And this is in reverse. Hmm. And then we got thinking of you. So I feel like, um, I feel like this weekend, like I said, you're going to be kind of like in this relaxed mode. So if anybody tries to come with you with any type of drama or whatever, you're going to just ignore it. You're going to be like, who cares? Like, I don't care. <laughs> whatever like i'm chilling i'm bobbing out i'm relaxing like i don't got time for that drama like it is what it is um and whoever this person is that feels like it's easy to love you they're definitely thinking of you it's like i said you make this person happy okay this person feels like you are too good for them girl they push you up on a very high pedestal when it comes down to like who you are they put you on a very high pedestal look at this you're exclusive like i said they put you up on a very high pedestal they know like you're a one of a kind type of woman it's going to be hard to find someone like you because they're not going to be able to find anybody like you you know um a woman like you doesn't come around every day is what I'm hearing. Okay, so we got nobody can come between us. Wow. 
So I feel like this person wants to give you some reassurance about this connection that you guys have with each other. I'm getting like, let's take things to the next level. Mm. Look at this. I want to spoil you. So like I said, I see some, um, <laughs> I saw some foot rubbing um, or feet rubbing, whatever y'all want to put it or however y'all want to put it. Um, I see that happening, but whatever you want this person to do, they'll do it. They want to spoil you, back rubs, materialistic things, whatever. But I feel like they really want to spoil you with their time because I feel like that's really all you want. You just want to spend time with this person, you know, you guys have like a really cozy weekend together. I see like some rain too. It's just like cold, you know, like sweater weather. But yeah, you guys could be chilling now, watching movies, eating leftovers or ordering some food. But yeah, this person wants to spoil you. This is all they think about too. I feel like They've been waiting to, um, wow, <laughs> they've been waiting to spoil someone. They've been waiting to run into that one divine feminine that's going to really be deserving of what they have to offer. So I feel like this person does have like a lot to offer. We got first class flight, okay? We got plane on the way. Wow. And then we got cheater in reverse. Okay. So some of y'all, I'm not even going to lie to you. Be careful with who you tell um, <clears throat> about your connection with this person because I feel like as soon as they find out who you're dealing with, they're going to be like, oh, he's a cheater or, you know, their ex or somebody's gonna try to come towards you like, oh, he cheated on me, he gonna cheat on you. And that's why you're kind of like, who cares? Like, I don't care about that. Like, why are y'all coming at me? You know, why are y'all bothering me? Why y'all? Why are y'all even worried about it? But it's just because they don't wanna see you guys together because they know how this person is gonna treat you. Also, this person has felt unappreciated in the past. And you know what? <laughs> um, for some of y'all, they feel unappreciated, <clears throat> excuse me, by their ex. Their ex could have been the one that actually cheated on them. That's what I'm getting. And now that ex sees them moving towards you or you guys could already be in connection, but they're no longer giving that person their energy and their time. And they know what type of... Um, person you're dealing with is someone that's going to make sure you're good someone that's going to put you on first class flights i want to spoil you like they know what type of it's i'm getting princess treatment okay princess treatment because they know you're exclusive and whoever this is they're not going to be able to come in between us because it's right here nobody can come between us nobody's not going to be able to stop this connection at all and then we got the plane in the background especially with look plane i'm on the way so someone could be at a distance from you for some of you divine feminines this person could be at a distance from you um and they want to put you on a flight so you can come see them For some of y'all, they just gonna pop up on you. Like they just gonna call you and be like, I'm on the way, I'm on the way to your city. Like literally just pop up in your city. Like, yeah, I'm out here. Where you at? <laughs> Where you stay at? What's your address so I can um <laughs> so I can get the Uber? <laughs> um, but yeah, we got playful. I told y'all, this person puts you in a very um happy go lucky energy is just like you feel like you on cloud nine with this person 
And I feel like they feel the same way. It's very childlike energy. It's very beautiful. It's very beautiful. And I also feel like this person is going to bring out that inner child in you as well. Kind of like help you remember, you know, some things about yourself. It's very beautiful. I just say yes haters i told y'all it's gonna be people hating on this connection they don't want y'all to be together but nobody can come between us and we got haters nobody can come between us haters nobody can come between us. <laughs> not even haters are going to be able to stop this i told y'all nobody not gonna be able to stop it you just not it was meant to be. It was meant to be. <laughs> All right. So we got I've changed. All right. I'm hearing that song in my head. Um, I think it's by Jaheen and Keisha Cole. I changed for you. Yeah, this person changed for you. This person changed for you, honey. Look, you got me hooked. I told y'all. You got this person hooked. They're not going nowhere. You Loving you is so easy that you got this person hooked on you. They're not going nowhere. Y'all hear that airplane? First class flight. Look, nothing to prove. Didn't I just... This is you, Divine Feminine. That's why I said, you be like, who cares? Like, I don't do drama. I don't look. All I'm hearing is that, in that song in my head. When Cardi B said, I don't care what no bitch said. I don't care what no said. I don't speak dog old. Yeah, you talking about <laughs> I don't. And you don't have nothing to prove to these people. You don't have nothing to prove to these people. Look, I got what you need. That's why I said <laughs> this person has a lot to offer, okay? This person has so much to offer you, Divine Feminine, and there's so many people trying to interrupt this connection because they know what type of treatment you're about to get. Princess treatment, period. It's coming. It's coming. It's coming. It's coming. It's coming. This is getting ready to happen. Nobody not going to be able to stop this either. Nobody. But anyways, <laughs> y'all already know to do if it resonated. Hit that thumbs up button so we can get out there to more beautiful divine feminine so we can keep healing, growing, and glowing. And I will see you guys in my next one. God bless.